Ladies and gentlemen, Fortnite just put out the biggest update of the year with the Dragon Ball collab. We got some Dragon Ball skins. We got a new POI, two brand new mythics. But what really stood out to me was the new versus mode. And if that sounds familiar, it's because it's a series that we've done on this channel versus people like Nick830 and Typical Gamer, where we queue in, we grab a bounty on each other, and we try to hunt each other down. Now it's officially in the game, and I don't think they took inspiration from it necessarily, but it pretty much works the same way. You go up to any bounty board the bounty boards are no longer the same they're no longer uh there's no longer bounties you basically queue in to a versus mode match and i'm gonna show you exactly how that works and it's really important because it's part of the challenges there's a board right down here we're in lazy lagoon it's back and i have i have a theory about lazy lagoon that i think you're gonna want to hear lazy lagoon is back and so are cannons because of it and my theory is that because lazy lagoon got brought back by this the reality tree and it brought back cannons with it the planes just got updated in this in the game files they got nerfed you can't glider redeploy out of the planes they also are affected by impulse nades and a few other small changes it makes me think that maybe the reality tree is going to bring back a poi that had planes similar to frosty flights and that could be a way that fortnite brings planes back by the way as you can see i just grabbed a bounty and it's waiting for an, an opponent someone else on the map has to go up to the versus board and accept it and they will be matched up against me once that happens i'll see their name and i'm also going to see their location on the map but they will also see my location on the map so it's a it's kind of a, a double-edged sword i think this is going to be a lot better because it's it's a more fair environment basically both players are going against each other they both know where each other are and you have to opt into it it's not forced on you in any way this is going to add some more story to the matches it's also part of the challenges and if you do all these challenges you can unlock xp and a free glider once you unlock all the challenges and get all the dragon balls now you might be wondering what's going on with the map there's some capsules those capsules actually drop the new mythics you can also find the new mythics in certain vending machines the vending machines are kind of random whether they offer the mythics or not you'll see the dragon ball symbol on the mythic if it offers it someone out there in this match there we go marine dog and they're actually very close and now if i eliminate them i complete the quest complete the challenge and i get the 75 gold so i'm i'm rushing towards them but i gotta be careful because they know that i'm coming towards them and i know and i got the boogie coming in one pump easy okay dude the boogie bomb is kind of ridiculous uh, in these 1v1s and i'm assuming the 1v1s in build mode are going to be a lot more intense because you can get into a build fight and it, it probably will stall out storm is closing is there a bounty board in uh sleepy sound i want to see if i can get like three bounty eliminations this match alone this versus mode honestly it's, it's it's kind of like a mini game within the match there's one near the eight bushes oh, oh yeah, it shows up on the mini map if i'm close enough you're right you're right you're right i see it now and don't worry guys i'm gonna show you the new mythics and how powerful they are because they are pretty powerful there's definitely some finesse to it though to try to use the new mythics you got to be a little bit careful you could get beamed while charging up the kamehameha but you could also use the nimbus cloud to really move around and put yourself in a good spot and by the oh there's actually a new mythic right here so this is the kamehameha and it's got two uses and it has a long charge up but it does a lot of damage it can one shot a llama I have a bounty now. They're all the way in Chonkers. That is far, far away. There's there's a rift to go. You guys don't know. There's a little trick with the rift to go. We're on this side. Rifts straight down into the street. Grab the splashes and I'm able to use the rift. And okay, okay, there's more capsules coming down. I see I see a flare to the left over here. Might have to might have to go for a quick beam and el eliminate my okay. This guy is going for it. He is going for the uh, capsule, bro. I gotta stop him. He actually opened the capsule. Dude, he's he's somewhere in front of me. He knows I'm here too. That's the scary part. Is he knows I'm here. Is he in a bush? Okay, grabbing the cloud. Grabbing the new Kamehameha. The cloud gives you some insane boost, man. I see him, bro. I see him. I have a boogie bomb here too, bro. Do I boogie bomb him and then hit him with the Kamehameha while he's boogied? Is that is that valid strat? Hey, it's me, Goku. He's flying away too? I'm gonna have to ask you to stop. No! 
You're so lucky. You're so lucky. Okay, I have an, I have two more uses, and he's kind of in a he's kind of in a crap spot right now. Yeah, 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 yeah. You need to get back here, buddy. There's no escape at this time. You know what? You know what? I could have done that to you 15 minutes ago. I just want you to know that. I just want you to know that. But forgive me for wanting to play with the new mythic. We're going to use it against someone who's a little bit less stuck up and more willing to engage in a fight. Why do you even accept the bounty board? I'm, I'm actually going to go grab another bounty board. Why accept the bounty board if you don't want to fight? And by the way, if two people Kamehameha each other at the same time, it actually like clashes. Like you have like a like an actual clash with them and, and you can like whoever goes first probably gets, gets it off. Like because you're going to take damage while charging up, but... Bro, everyone's flying around with, with the Kamehameha. Okay, okay, we gotta take someone out here. We gotta take someone out here. Ain't no way. Ain't no way. We get him out of the sky? Get him out of the sky? It's so loud, too, when you use it. It's so loud. That's the, the part you have to watch out for. So this guy's probably gonna try to... Holy smokes. I'm, honestly, I'm, I'm getting out of this location. Everybody's got mythics here, bro. I'm scared. Come on, come on. Just, just, just give it to me. Give it to me! Ah! I love it. Shockwaves plus the cloud would is probably probably an insane combo. And you can cancel the cloud, by the way, while using it. Like you can you can hit the cloud and then like cancel in midair and drop down. So like right now, if I see somebody, I can just drop right on their heads. Boom. By the way, if you guys did not know, the charge SMG has been hot fixed. It now has way less recoil. I still don't recommend you use it. Just keep that in mind. I don't recommend you use it, but it did get hot fixed. It has less recoil. And the fact that you have to charge it is, is enough for me not to use it. Here we go, baby. Oh, shoot. I accidentally pulled my uh, shoot. Wait, wait, wait. Is there? Ah, oh, dude, I thought there was a mythic here. It's just another one of these. Wait, does he have it? He's got a dude. He's gonna try to kamehameha me, bro. But you know what's gonna happen is I'm just gonna delete him. Come on, bro. Try me. Try me. By the way, guys, don't forget to use code Cipher PK in the item shop if you want to support me while getting the Dragon Ball skins. What's up, man? It. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe.